today we're going to talk about fruit flies and how to get them out of your house. Now, yesterday we opened up the door and a whole horde of fruit flies came flying in our house and so we had to figure out how to trap them. So I went on the internet and I found, well we had this from last year and what they like to do is they like to sit on the top and sniff the fumes but uh, we can only find one or two, maybe two fruit flies actually in here because they can get out of these big holes. Then I tried this and I made smaller holes. And we have about one, two, three fruit flies in this thing. And, but they can still squeeze their little bodies back through the, the holes. Now, we tried this for the first time. And we have good over 10 fruit flies floating dead in this thing. And we are going to show you how to make this out of stuff you have in the house. So, what we have here is just a regular water bottle that we drink all the water. And we're going to throw it out, or recycle it, but we can make this into a fruit fly trap. So, cut into, we have to, there, we have to cut this around the top. Cut the top off and we put this inside of here. And now this one actually still has the water in it, so it'd be nice to have at this point. It'd be nice. It's falling in. I, just a minute. I'm back, and what we need to do is make this dry because we're going to put some tape on here. And there we go. Now, take some tape, and you tape, uh oh, gape, and you tape around the edge of this thing, the, all of the edges, so that the fruit flies can't come back up, wandering back up through the sides. There we go. Just regular tape. Just get on the edge. Make sure you don't miss any because they do find their way. They have their ways to get out. Um, actually, they just accidentally do it. But we don't want any accident, <laughs> accidental re release of fruit flies. So make sure that's good in tape. Then take apple cider vinegar and you're just going to pour a little bit in there and you're done you have a new fruit fly trap and I'm going to get rid of the rest of these so it doesn't distract any of them from from going in there so there you have it the best fruit fly trap ever because look at all those carcasses yum bye <laughs>